Tuberculosis is an infective disease caused by bacteria. The bacteria causing tuberculosis disease is called Mycobacterium tuberculosis. So going back to history, so initially in the earlier days, in our primitive days, tuberculosis was termed as the captain of white death. The reason being, the lungs of an infected patient were looked totally white on autopsy. That indicates that it is a disease where it will eat away the lungs. The lungs will be almost like a cheese. So that is the reason they call it as white death and it is called the captain of the white death. So, and it is a communicable disease. That means a patient who is infected with a tuberculosis disease can have a high propensity to transfer the disease to others. The main uh, way through which this disease propagates is through droplets. That is when we speak, most of our sputum droplets will be dispersed into the air. This tuberculosis bacillus or bacteria will be contained in these droplets and whoever inhales or uh, ingests these uh, droplets will be prone to develop this disease. So one should remember that whoever exposed to tuberculosis may not develop the disease. In India, where tuberculosis is prevalent, there is almost a chance of 95% of whole of Indian population are infected with tuberculosis bacteria. Every infected person need not develop the disease. So what happens is, disease is different from infection. So from birth itself, we will be infected with the bacillus or bacteria which are mostly in the environment, in what we air, in the air, what we inhale. So they enter into our body who have the strong immunity. This bacteria, once it enters, the immunity of our body will contain or limit the infection and it will be supposedly present in somewhere in the lymph nodes. So in the coming generation, as the age progresses, once the person weakens, this bacteria may be reactivated, means the bacteria may be sleeping inside the lymph node or anywhere. It may get reactivated or some super added infection, that means another tuberculosis bacteria may enter into the body and that may cause the disease.